spending which profited no one but the war merchants. In contrast, one 50 megawatt OTEC ship could have provided power as well as close to 120,000 cubic meters of desalinated water a day to Haitian and Indonesian earthquake victims, possibly preventing cholera in Haiti, and in Japan such a ship could have provided immediate power to Fukushima's reactors, maintaining cooling of their cores and spent fuels, or in contrast, could have desalinated water for spraying onto the same rather than the corrosive salt water that was used. Even though there hasn't been an awareness of the greenhouse gas problem for decades, and the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change produced a treaty at the 1992 summit in Rio, concentrations have continued to rise. If the prospect of trillions of dollars worth of clean energy a year can't motivate us to address this problem, then surely the God the future of our children will. Just can't bear, you give me fever 